All right. So, Merry Christmas to Merry everybody Christmas. that actually gives a shit. <laughs> uh, happy Festivus. Uh, Merry Krampus. I don't know. Whatever you may. What are you doing? What am I doing? Yeah, what are you doing? Well, I started with the outside of the building. And, oh, uh, and now you're wake, making your way in to find us. Yep. Same place we always are. Yep, waiting for everything to resin because it looks kind of goofy. Yeah, and there we go. Did you see I put out some Christmas stuff? I did. I did see uh -huh. the Christmas stuff. Yep, since we've kind of not made a video in a couple months because uh, all kinds of crap's been busy. Uh, yep. I mean, I get to start out a new year in a in a new home. Yay! Even though it's kind of an old age home. Oh, that's all right. You know. It's a new home. <laughs> it's not an apartment no more. <laughs> it's no. Yeah. It's not an apartment, so I get to be start the new year off in a house. Yep. Mm -hmm. So that's kind of taken up a lot of my time in the last couple of months, as you know. Yep. Because you've been enjoying that lovely journey. Yes. So looking at different houses, saying, "Hey, you should buy this house. This is my dream house," and then, well. That didn't work out. We won't discuss the house on Northumberland. <laughs> that made me sad. And it's still pending too, but you know, I, know. I, I don't know what's going on with that. But so, the the original house I looked at, mm, we're gonna go with, gonna go with it. Yep. So it's already done deal. It's the the stuff's been signed. Just have to another two weeks and then the closing and yippee skippy dippy. Yippee skippy dippy. Yep. So if anybody asks me if I want something for Christmas, well, you can't top that. <laughs> um, a new mattress, um, new bed sheets, so you can get rid of those ugly, flowery grandma ones. Those came from my mother. I like those ones. You only like them because I said they were ugly. Well, yeah, that's kind of the point. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I know. I mean, you only sleep on it. It's not like you're going to sit there and stare at it all day. Blah. No, but we need a pretty bedroom. All right. Well, that t comes with time. Yeah, I know, I know. I know the mattress needs to be replaced. Yes, I do know that. Yes, the mattress, and we need to unpackage my Your pillow, pillow that I yep. bought and let it air out since it's memory foam, and memory foam generally has a little bit of fuming. It, it says 48 hours of letting it breathe on yeah, the package. Yeah. Uh, you can you can unpack it earlier than two days. Thank you. So, as I was discussing earlier, I was going to have do another radio show next week. Yeah. And you'll be sitting here on the good old knee. On your knee. Or on my lap. I don't know. Can you, can your chair support that? I don't know. This is a wooden chair, so I don't know. It's wooden, but it's also got your little woven seat thing, that's, that's so it's not a solid seat. It's all right. When you're here, I'll just get another chair next to me then. Or you can just pull the ottoman over and sit on that. Uh, which I normally do when I'm out there. Yeah, I mean, it's only going to... Because that's the only place I can sit. It's only going to be for, you know, a few minutes. It's not like it's a, it's a big thing. All right, fine. We'll give them a couple of minutes. Yeah, we'll give you a couple uh -huh. minutes. You know, and then I could take you over my knee and smack your ass. Oh, my God. <laughs> well, you going to record the sound of that so that, you know. Hey, you recorded smacking me in the back of the head, so don't give me any. I that. didn't record it. It was over the air when we were DJing. It doesn't matter. It's there. Well, it's, it's not there. mortalized other than just in some people's minds. You gave me a concussion. I did not give you a concussion. <laughs> I was trying to help stimulate hair growth in your bald spot. <laughs> Good luck with that. I know. I got a lot more to smack. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. Shut <laughs> up, you. Oh, God. So anyways, yes. this, this, was, this was our just our Christmas video for, you know, two days. Two days? Yeah, two days before Christmas. So, yeah. But um, Yay. I do have a lot of other content and complaining and, yep, and cringeworthy stuff. <laughs> yeah. 
I mean, if you're wanting to record that today, we need to change our outfits or something. I mean, I am proud of you for finally changing out of um, your wedding outfit. Oh, I only wore that for like, that what? Oh, like three weeks? Yeah, oh my god. Damn near. At least that's what it seemed like. Um, but yeah, I'm proud of you for finally changing out of that. <laughs> All I did was change Which my shirt. <laughs> well, I mean, at least it looks different from the view of the camera. Yeah, then the Hail Satan. Woo! Oh, it says Hail yours Santa. Says, so, yeah, yours says Hail Santa. My, my tag says Hail Satan. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, I'm going with that. That and my update of my profile. Yeah. Yes. I... I I, I um, don't know if I'm going to get any feedback on it, but I don't really give a crap. Probably not. Nobody gives feedback on anything, or they come to me because they're too scared to come to you. Um, I don't yeah. know why. I don't know either, but yeah, everybody's kind of intimidated by me or something. <laughs> I don't know, but I'm the one that's the problem. You're the problem, and I'm the imitation. I'm the intimidator. <laughs> The instigator. Yeah. Yeah. You instigate crap, and I, I spout off, and yeah. Yep. So that's going to be probably one of my New Year's resolutions is to quit being the one to spout off and let you do it. Okay. I make subtle but, I make subtle hints, as you notice, with a lot of things. Yeah, and a lot of people here in SL are too dense to pick up on the subtle hints. Duh, 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 duh. I need big words to tell me how you feel. Yep. But yeah, um, I am interested to see if anybody reads your profile. I mean, we did have one person that read your profile, and it was kind of weird, like, why are you going in to look at his profile? Oh, that was before I changed it to currently what it is, but yeah. Oh, well, was, yes. Yeah. And, and notice that I was partnered to JH now. Yeah. Um, and that you put a pic in there about me. Yep. Although it's really short compared to mine. It's really short, but, you know, nobody in SL really needs to know what goes on otherwise, right? Well, no. But you could have been a little mushy. Uh, what do you want, mashed potatoes? Mushy, not mashy. Um, mayonnaise. <laughs> Leave me alone with mayonnaise. <laughs> I couldn't Ugh. resist. It was kind of there. I know you couldn't. You never can. <laughs> Nasty. Yeah. Yeah. So next year is going to be kind of fun, but um, yeah, I don't know. It's going to be kind of interesting. I mean, it, and my own other personal channel is going to have a lot of documentation on on the house journey. Yeah. So that's going to be kind of interesting. But those that know me personally know that channel. But other than that. <laughs> yep. Nope. You don't know. need people knowing where, where we're going to be living. So. Nope. They can just know that we'll be somewhere in Massachusetts. So there we go. Because most everybody knows that since you've mentioned multiple times um, that you're a mass hole. Yep. And even posted it so. on my Facebook. Yep. Yep. So. Now you understand. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I know. I told that to one of my coworkers the other day and she looked at me real weird and I'm like, yeah, that's what they call each other in Massachusetts or mass holes. And she just bust out laughing. Yeah. But I mean, that statement is fairly right on the point. Yep. With, it is. With how we are here. Yeah. Well, not everybody. I mean, there are, it, there are transplants that come here that are just kind of, you know, buzzing with a no fly zone around their head. Okay. I'm trying to make. I'm trying to remember the quote from George Carlin made about people are how people are stupid and have like the elevator doesn't go all the way to the top and um, yeah, there's a bunch of other things. That's not just transplants, even though they are transplants if they move there. But yeah, no, we see that a lot. Mm, I, I even with our short time in SL, we see that on a daily basis. Yeah. 
when we're in. Oh, so. when I go to Albany, it's the same thing. It's uh, I could I tell you that on the phone that every time mm-hmm. every time I come over Route 20, and I'm behind somebody with a Massachusetts tag on their car, they're always doing five to ten miles an hour under the speed limit, and it's it's, so it's annoying. Yeah, but as soon as they get to the mass line, it's like it's like time to drive like an asshole. I'm like okay. Mine's kind of city limits line every day. Yeah, yeah. I think they're afraid. I don't know. They're, they're afraid of the na- New York State troopers. I don't know. I've met a few mm. of those troopers, and they're they're nice guys. So yeah. Mm. Anyways, yep, you'll be here. You'll be spending New Year's with me. Yep. So. You surprised me with a Christmas present of coming out for New Year's. So, yeah. Yep. Yep. There you go. So, it'll be a w- nice little New Year's. I would say that I was physically getting you something for Christmas, but, well, you'll just have to settle for me. Um, I've got enough on my plate when it comes to the first of the, the I know. Christmas and the first of the year. Well, and not like you need one more thing to move if I bought you something, so. Right. <laughs> I got you enough. got enough. I got enough crap to move. I know. You need to start saving your boxes from work. Yeah, but like I said, um, it's going to be a slow move because then I got to, uh, I also have to clean this place, too. After it's it'll empty. It'll be easier to clean. Well, that won't take that long since it'll be empty. Right. Well, that's what I mean. It's 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 um if I don't use any of my uh, vacation time or anything like that, I can do it on the weekends and maybe after work. Yep. It won't take you that long. No. No. That or I think they'll drop your drop the kid off over there while you go to work and let him do the cleaning. Hmm. But uh, I think the biggest move, the hardest move, is going to probably be uh, cleaning out my storage unit. Well, that you don't have to do super fast. Yeah, I don't want to. Well, I, I know you don't want to keep paying on it, but yeah. you need to get out of where you're at now faster. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah, storage unit will take a day. Mm, are you sure? Yeah. I've seen your storage. Well, it's chock full of crap and you've <laughs> pulled stuff uh, you've pulled crap out of boxes when you've taken me over there. Yeah. And then you didn't put it back in the box. Right. So you got a lot of loose stuff in there. Yeah, I do. There's a lot of stuff in that place, but I'm going to do what I did when I moved into my first house and load it into the back of a truck, U-Haul. And if the garage is empty at the house, I'm just gonna all stick it in there and then go through it. Mm-hmm. And that way, you know, I don't have to spend any more money with you all. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. After yeah. thirteen years of being in storage, I can get rid of it. Yeah. <coughs> of course, then again, my apartment's not big enough to hold all that stuff. <laughs> no. I got enough stuff here as it is. I know. It's a it's a chore to try to find a place to sit oh, when I'm out bad. there. Really? <laughs> it's not that bad. What's on the ottoman right now? Um, one of my work shirts. Is that it? Yeah. I'm surprised. <laughs> Normally, you have your certifications from work. Nope. In frames, and you have your printer from work. Nope. And bunch of other crap probably nope. from work no nope. actually you can sit on the chair holy crap you cleared off the chair it was cleared off ah. the last time yeah hmm. i know i had to find a place, it... i had to find a place to hang my my stuffs on the wall at the new place and you'd be like well, no <laughs> no we can hang that stuff probably put it in one of the bedrooms that we're going to turn into, like, the computer room. Yeah, I haven't really decided yet. I know that uh, I'm going to uh, B 
sleeping in that back bedroom. Yeah. The one that's currently but painted. Eventually, yellow. we're going to be upstairs. Eventually. Eventually, yes. Eventually. Eventually. Yeah. I just got to decide how we're going to decorate it. Uh huh. Make it all, all sexy and romantic and. Well, first you have to yeah. paint it. Well, duh. I mean, because you remember the room is. It's it, horrid. It's. The ceiling is painted green and white. Yeah, it's horrid. Probably kind of do something with the floors. Sand the floors and restain and reseal or something. I don't know. I have all kinds of ideas running around in my head. Mm -hmm. And different paint colors and whatnot running around in my head. I'm just thinking about the oh. yard more than I am the inside of the house. <sighs> well, we're going to keep the beach plums for sure. Mm hmm Because that's from Cape Cod. Or from P-Town. So, we definitely need to keep those. So we have a little bit of Cape Cod at home. Well, the springtime's coming quick enough, and and uh, I know the first thing I'm going to tackle is the yard. At least the front yard. Well, probably be best, because everything will be pretty much dead. Or starting to come back to life to where it's easier to cut back. So, anyways. Yeah, anyways, we're getting off topic here. So that's a, yeah, that's we a topic are. for the other channel, not for this one. Yeah. <coughs> anyways, back to the uh, the SL at hand. That um, Yeah, would you change your chair again? No, it's the same chair. I just noticed it was white. My rainbowy chair. No, it's rainbowy. Oh. You're, you're probably, your uh, environment lights are probably different. Yeah, maybe. No, it's rainbowy. It's light pastel rainbow. Mm, anyway, we'll leave this little video like it is and uh, go from there. I know nobody's going to want to join us or anything like that, but, uh, you know, it'll be kind of fun. Yeah. At some point. We will be. If yeah. We can get anybody to join us. Um. I don't know, maybe at some point when you get moved into the house and everything, we can get your son back in the SL and then have him kind of do commentary as to what he thinks about it nowadays <laughs> from his old days. I don't know. Uh, well, we'll see what happens there. Right? Or the difficulty of, well, because he's pretty much a noob, so the difficulties of starting out in SL nowadays? I don't know. That's an idea. Oh, well, yeah. But we'd have to rope him in on it. Yeah, well, I know. Yeah, I know. Well, anyway, we'll just wrap this up for right now. and uh, Okay. Until next Saturday. Next time? Next Saturday? Next Saturday. Okay. okay. What do you mean, okay? I don't know. When are you taking me on my date? Um, It's probably going to be Saturday night. I mean, it's only... 20 of 1 in the afternoon. Yeah, but I gotta do my makeup, do my hair, get dressed. I'll put you on a little um, Lazy Susan and we'll get some airbrush and we'll just... Oh, you're gonna do the airbrush? They do actually have airbrush makeup. You I know, know they this, do. right? Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah. I've never done it. I've watched people do it and it kind of scares me because they all scrunch up their faces as the makeup is going on. Yeah. And then when they unscrunch, then it, oh my God, shows you how what you're going to look like when you're old. Okay. I'm not I'll, far I'll, of a stretch from where I am sitting right now. I meant old and wrinkly and everything. Well. I, I'll, I'll show you pictures afterwards. I, I told you I can, I can just dye my hair white. Mm, I mean, you could, you could pull off the silver fox thing. Yeah. I mean, your beard's already going there. Your goatee thingy. Yeah. Mm hmm Yeah. We'd probably have to do some purple shampoo on your mustache, though. Cause it's purple? Kinda that. Yeah, purple shampoo. Oh, my God, there's so much that you don't know that women go <laughs> through to look nice for their men. All right. Blonde hair. The purple cancels out yellow. So, yeah. Okay. Blondes will use it. Or old ladies will use it to keep their hair from going from 
like that pretty silver. I feel like I'm gonna be your nasty I'm, brassy. I feel like you're gonna. I'm gonna be your, your, your. I'm gonna be your test subject on stuff, aren't I? No. Can you like? No. Can you like bring my goatee back up to like the rest of my hair color? I could just for men. Yeah. Well, I know that too. Uh huh. Yeah. But we won't do like. Hello. You have food. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. You have sausages. <laughs> <laughs> the sausage delivery. Oh, the sausage. Hello. <laughs> sausage, thank you for the peanut gallery. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. We probably thought we were wrapped up, but we weren't. No. Nope. Because we went off on another tangent. Because yeah, that's we how we are. All right. Well, enjoy the content. I mean, it's just 20 minutes of rambles and... Uh, Till the next time. That's how it always is. But yeah. Till next time. Ladies. Like, subscribe. Hey, wait a minute. I gotta okay. do the whole spiel. All right. Of like, subscribe, comment down below, and don't forget to hit that little bell to get notifications when we post a new video. Hmm. Yep. Did I sound all professional? I'm saying all that. I hope so. Yeah, you did. Okay. So anyway, see you guys next time, and Merry Christmas. No, we shouldn't sing it. <laughs> Feliz Navidad. Okay, bye. Bye.